Hey guys, Trevor here. And in this video, I'm gonna show you how to check someone's last location on iPhone. It's pretty quick and easy, so let's jump right in. Now, let's first open up the settings here. Tap on your name at the very top, and then tap on Find My. At the very top, you can see Find My iPhone is turned on. I'm gonna tap on it, and you want to see at the very bottom, Send Last Location is turned on. So it says automatically send the location of this iPhone to Apple when the battery is critically low. So if you want to have the last location basically signaled out to Apple for you to be able to find or anyone else, you wanna make sure that's toggled on. After that, there are two different places you can look. Let's go back here and tap on Privacy and Security and then Location Services at the very top. From there, we'll just scroll to the bottom, tap on System Services, and again, scroll to the bottom and tap on Significant Locations. If this is toggled on, it will show you the last locations that you were at. Basically, it tracks some of your common locations that you go to, and it'll show up under Summary or Recent Records here. Now, I usually have this turned off, so if the other person has it turned off, Another place to check is the Find My App. So just search for the Find My App. There it is here. And you'll be able to see I can tap on, say, Devices or People. Let's go to Devices. And I can scroll down and, for instance, tap on the Haley iPhone. And I'll be able to see the exact location of it right now in addition to the Apple Watch. Now keep in mind, if this did die, you can see the battery of it right now. If it did die, it would send out the last location of exactly where it was. Whether it was an iPhone, a Mac computer, AirPods, whatever it was, I'll be able to find it and track down that exact last location as long as it hasn't been moved before that battery died. I hope this helps. If it did, hit the subscribe button down below. It really helps me out. And I'll catch you on the next one.